All right, so today we're back on a tips and tricks video for Street Fighter 6. If you guys want me to give you tips and tricks, leave your Street Fighter name in the comments below and eventually I'll get to you as well, okay? Okay, well one thing is you're jumping back for no reason. Nice, I don't mind the DP first knockdown. Okay, that in neutral. That in neutral is not good. Ah. Spin knuckle is kind of good and bad. So I don't mind that one, but you gotta be careful for DIs, of course. Jumping out the corner. I like that. I do that. Okay, there it is again. The, the hooligan got you killed again. You can't be doing that. <laughs> there it is again. You got hit again. Okay. Oh. That's a really bad habit you have that's getting... That's, that's what's losing you games. Part of it right there. Okay. Okay, we need some combos. Because he hit that DI, but there was no combo follow-up. That's a side switch. You put him in a corner. Damn, you're in a better spot. Uh, you're going to get hit by that every time. <laughs> do, do that on wake out. Do, do it. Okay. You try to do spiral into DP. Nah, you get a scratch. That. that is not a good idea. See, you've been going for that for a while now. And it's worked for the most part, but that's another bad habit. That's just constant you meter in, in games. Wake up spiral arrow. Nah, stop parking up with things. Okay, we got a lot of things here. Mainly it's just like bad habits that worked for you before, but they're not working for you now because you're higher ranked and they're not going to keep working for you. But the main Goal. It's like, it's like you play like you have to go somewhere, which is fine. You could play chaotic, but let's try to control the chaos a little bit. The first thing is you're jumping back for no reason with Cami when you can't do nothing at full screen. These are the two moves you have to combat out of space. You ain't reaching them at all. So let's we'll just stop double jumping back because A, you're putting yourself in the corner and you you don't have a move to combat them. It's the light auto attack because it does a combo for you and you're plus 26 frames. So with one dash, you're plus seven. So there you get a setup, which you know this. You go for grab here a lot, but you could do something better as well. You could go for a down heavy. So here we have a mashing on wake up. Light punch, the fastest punch you could do uh, on the wake up. You get a 50%er based off him mashing. 58% of him mashing. So there's something else you could do after spiral is dash up, down heavy. Also, what well, I said, the controlled chaos that you could do. Your controlled chaos would be right here in this. Shit. After this, this is where you go crazy ham. If they block the down heavy, you're still plus one frame, so it's still your turn. Now, let's say they're conditioned already. Now, this is where the controlled chaos comes in. Because you could do things like this. You could even EX the hooligan. And get a combo right after as well. Again, you're plus 26. You could dash up, grab, do anything over over again. If you think they're gonna DP, you just simply block it into combo until they explode. And another thing is this is really good. You're getting a lot with spin knuckle and spire arrow, which is okay. Spire arrow is really hard to get that. But perfect spacing. I recommend doing EX, practicing the ranges, practicing how fast you could do it to get plus frames. 
the closer you are to his toes, the more plus you are for dive kick. That's just a little like tip. If you're around like elbow area below, if you're like elbow area is gonna be zero. If you hit the legs, usually you're plus. That's like the, the golden rule to remember. And this is another thing you can stack to your controlled chaos. Another thing, when you get hit, you love to wake up with, like you love waking up here or, or here. They see this, they see this on my way when you wake up, don't do that. Just a back recover and play some neutral. And for combos and all that, Check out the Kami Mono Controls combo that I have on my channel. Check out the guide. I, I go over some of the things I go over here. Oh, one other thing, one other huge thing. You do spin knuckle and to jump forward to get the cross up, you're plus here. You're plus three, take your advantage. You do spin knuckle and then you jump over. But you're plus, you're plus three. Take your plus buttons when you have them. 